if you flush a toilet in Midtown Manhattan, Union Square, downtown Wall Street, as well as most of northern Brooklyn, Pratt flushes their toilets here, Williamsburg, Bushwick, parts of Queens, all those toilets and sinks and showers all drain to this treatment plant. You guys know where we are right now? You know what borough we're in? Nobody? Take a guess. Anybody know what borough we're in? Still in Brooklyn, exactly. So, and then on the other side of the water right here is Queens. And in between Brooklyn and Queens is Newtown Creek, the water that we're going to travel on. Uh, Newtown Creek is connected to the East River and it connects to um, the Atlantic Ocean. We're really kind of in the geographic center of New York City here. You'll see it's a very industrial landscape. Uh, but this was a natural waterway, and throughout time through the 1800s, when New York City began to grow and industrialize, Newtown Creek became one of the homes of sort of maritime industry, which is because everything back then in the 1800s was basically moved by boat. Uh, we didn't have cars yet, we didn't have trucks. So a lot of things were transported um, by ships, which is also one of the reasons that New York City became such a huge city in the United States, because it had great access to all the waterways. Uh, the treatment plant here, there's a, we could spend a whole day talking about it. It's one of 14 treatment plants in the city, and uh, it's the largest of the 14. It just completed this massive upgrade. This handles sewage from uh, over a million residents, so it handles a huge capacity. And uh, what it does is it basically filters through that water, uh, discharges the clean water into the East River, and then we saw the big boat, the sledge barge, that takes out sort of the, the final, almost the finished product of the sewage. Good morning. You coming in here? Negative. 